like that. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Always on the line, in the trenches like a nose guard Never been a sucker, man, my knuckle game crazy Leave your eye like a raccoon, punching them out like the baby They say, he a G, and he know for keeping it 100 Dirt on my boots, not my name, he so 100 I embarrass you, how you let shorty take a headshot for you You still ain't married, nigga What the fuck is we doing? What are we doing here? The black cat finally made it Fuck the, let's get straight to the Payments, payments. Let's get straight to these payments. Have y'all seen the commotion that Easy the Black Captain has caused in battle rap in the last 48 to 72 hours? He has people out of their minds, bro. Like, I feel I, I, I know we won the battle already. I watched the battle like four or five times. He won the battle. We're not, we're not about to do this. See, the thing is that kills me. I got a thousand videos on my channel. Over a thousand. Videos, breakdowns, recaps, blogs, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I've been doing this five, six, seven years now. I don't even, I lost count. I've been doing it for some time, right? I think it's, it's actually my sixth year. Um, and I broke down a lot of battles. And I've never had any scrutiny or any, like, you pick this person when that person. I don't get that. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm him when it comes to that. You know what I'm saying? Him hard away. I've been doing this for a while. Like, I don't get questioned. As far as like being biased in battles and things like that, my resume, it don't get questioned. We're like, I know y'all say my association or my being cool with Rock. I say when he lost. You, you know what I'm saying? And that's the one thing. He knows, they know, every MC knows that I'm cool with. If you lost, I'm going to say you lost. Like, I was running down Rock's battles that he lost. He lost to this person, lost that person, like that. When this, when that, when that. Because I don't see compromise or bias in when I'm picking battle winners. You either won or you lost. You know what I mean? But, um, and I seen Search say, you know, like, the bloggers can have influence and yada, yada, yada. He do what's safe. He said I do what's safe. I remember him saying that, but that was a different conversation. But, uh, Easy the Black Captain have fucked up the algorithm. Like, he got these dudes in a frenzy right now. Like, they in spaces all day. They running around. Like, they going crazy trying to figure out who's going to fit. And the funny thing is, this is how you know when it comes to battles who won versus who lost. This is the simplest way. The simplest way is to just pay attention to what the person does after the battle. Everything else is irrelevant. If the person is quiet, like he's like he's quiet. He may tweet once or twice a day. He's not really going back and forth with people. He's not trying to argue with folks. He's not trying to make you believe that he won a battle. He ain't doing that. Like in no way, shape, or form. He's not retweeting everybody who says easy 2 1 or whatever the case may be. He's not doing that. He's just not, right? Literally, like, yo, the fans will decide. I ain't tripping. The bloggers will decide. I ain't tripping. He's not even retweeting everybody whose blogs is out. He, like, you know what I'm saying? He might retweet it one and two every now and then, but he's not trying to make you feel like he won. He knows. He feels like when he walked out of there. And I want to talk about this crowd thing. Cause this crowd thing been killing me with the Hitman Holler versus Easy to Block Captain Battle. Everybody keeps saying Hitman had a rough crowd. Hitman did it. Da, da, da. Do y'all did y'all watch the face off? I just want to know, did you watch the face off? You know what I'm saying? Because and, and, and my main point in this is Easy to Block Captain's price has risen. He could damn near ask for 40 or 50 right now, and who's gonna tell him no? You gonna tell me no? I'm gonna go over here and they gonna give it to me. I just showed y'all that I'll go wherever I want. And you can't do nothing, but I'm gonna talk about that too. Um, he done fucked up the algorithm. He's overcharging niggas for what they did to the Cold Crush, and I appreciate and respect every part of that. But what I said is this, right? Um, Amy Holler talks about the crowd. See, the, the thing is, the detractors or the people who wanna try to talk about the battle and they gonna catch it on camera, bro, I caught it on camera. It does not get better on camera. Jump in these comments right now and tell me if the battle gets better on, on camera. Support Remy Ma. Chrome 23, the VOD is available. I have the VOD. You know, it is what it is. Yes, 
I was hot that the stream crashed. Yes, I said what I said, but no, I don't give a fuck. I'm still one of them in battle rap, and I'm going to continue to talk how I talk. It's just the way it is. If you don't respect the handle, I'm sure there's another channel. Now, Easy the Black Captain is not out here trying to prove he won a battle. When it comes to Hitman Holla, everything that they're talking about is the crowd, the crowd, the crowd, the crowd. Did y'all see the reactions that he was getting in his first round? Dog, he was tearing the building down. The celebration, the route that I took to get here wasn't an easy one. Nigga was cooking in the first round. Like, what are y'all talking about? Like, I hate, don't, don't get mad at the fact that they chose substance over what he brings. Like, there's nothing wrong with that. You feel like Hitman got the first, I'm Gucci with that. I don't feel like he got none of the rest of the battle. I'm sorry, like I just, and I'm not sorry because I listened to the material. The material. Hitman had a scheme about an airplane. Easy had a scheme about basketball. Do I need to say which one is better? Do I need to say which one was more, you know what I'm saying, was more impactful at the time? Do I need to say that? No, I don't, because you know. I never seen a fiend rebound off the glass. Like, nigga, what are we talking about here? And it's crazy how people who are trying or want to be near an MC or want to be included in the things that they got going on or invites to the show or yada yada. Nigga, you can still get invited to the Bags and Bodies debut if you say the nigga lost the battle. And if you can't say a nigga lost, then why are you friends with them? You should not be friends. And this is for media and everybody. You should not be trying to be cool with somebody that you cannot tell them they lost a battle. Like, what is... What, when did we come to this? Like, why is it here? We shouldn't even be, why are we debating this? All of the polls and everything that I said got easy, 90%. And now y'all moving the goalposts because like, oh, they was booing in the third. Or, oh, they was booing, nigga, they boo every battle, everywhere. You know how many different crowds and how many hecklers and shit like that? Now, do I feel like some of the shit that they was doing with Hitman was unwarranted? Yeah, I do. Niggas was in there doing the most. I'm from New York. He said it. Did y'all watch the face off? The man said in the face off, I'm from here today. I made my name hurt. I, I, I got it here. It's going to be more difficult for you. He said all of this. He said this. I made my name here. I've been doing this for 14 years. Whoop -de -whoop. He, this is the things that he said. I'm not making these words up for him. This is what he said. And if it don't go that way, you can't be mad at the same people that you said you made your name off of. Jesus Christ. Like, what are y'all doing? And now it goes to easy. He done made himself the most, one of the most important battle rappers out there, period. And he can raise his price to whatever he wants. And guess what? The leagues are going to just have to respect it. I hear that. Oh, I'm going to get this MC. Oh, and Charlie Clips, bro. Charlie Clips. Shout out to Charlie Clips. That's my dog, man. Uh, what did he tell me? And I don't, he didn't tell me nothing that he DM'd me the other day, right? Because I had made a blog, right? And I was talking about all the MCs that ain't gonna beat them. I was like, y'all y'all niggas might as well forget, you know what I'm saying? Y'all might as well clip up and grip up, start a writing group or something. Y'all niggas better do something because what I see right now, URL could look up and down they roster and they might not have three niggas that could beat him right now. I'm sorry, it is what it is. I ain't sorry, but you know, I just said it. So um, I'm trying to find this message, right? So this man told me, and he's my boy, you know what I'm saying? Like it ain't like, uh, you know what I'm saying? It ain't like it's a secret, you know what I'm saying? I can say what he said. He said, I said, what did I say? I said, he's going to be every one of them. He'll be all of them. We don't care. I said, I said, Charlie Clips right now is not going to be easy. That's what I said, Charlie Clips. I said, Charlie Clips is not going to be easy right now, right? I ain't even know this nigga be watching my blogs. But I mean, you know, they get watched a lot. So he said, uh, Y'all forgot Easy said I'm his number one battle rapper in his endgame. We will revisit this conversation of, in a few months. So he's like, we'll revisit this conversation like I'm going to beat him. This is how important he's gotten to where, bro, niggas, when I say somebody going to win a battle or lose a battle, I don't be having no God tier MCs just jumping in my DM, hitting me up to remind me what a nigga said. This is how important he is. He done got on the radar of all of these niggas. And when I say something about him or say they're going to win or they're going to lose or they don't got a chance, they literally hit me up to embellish or give me their point as to why they well. I was like, oh shit, this nigga only been there a couple years and that's how he got these niggas rattled. Um, so what I said earlier is like, you watch what people do after the battle. I'll be honest, I done see Hitman tweet more times in the last 
week than I've seen him do in the last two years. Like, literally, like, I'm, he's going back and forth with media. He's going back and forth with battle rappers. He's going back and forth with fans. He's going back and forth with everybody that will listen about this battle. It's like, bro, you, you know how, like, we'll call this terms and conditions. You know how, like, when you get a MacBook and you scroll a little bit, like, when you get a laptop and you first open it up and you power it up and it gives you that shit, you got to scroll all the way to the bottom. Most people don't read this shit. You should, but, I mean, I don't know either. So you scroll to the bottom and you click and accept yes. You accepted the terms and conditions of this battle. You knew where it was at. It was in New York. It was in Manhattan. I misquoted and thought Sony Hall was in Queens. You knew where it was at. Shit was in Manhattan. You think everybody from the Bronx and Brooklyn, they said the line was wrapped around the block, around the block, around the block, and around the block again. Like three round the blocks. <laughs> like not down this street, down that street, and around the next street. Did you think they was gonna come there and they was just gonna automatically cheer for you? See, the thing is, y'all niggas must not know what's going on out here. This nigga been taking the world by storm like 13, 14 battles in a row. Y'all thought that he was going to just be able to walk in there, star power it up, you know, have three of the first rounds and just beat this man. And it didn't happen like that. And you don't have to hold the nigga pocket. You don't have to be in the nigga pocket, bro. Y'all niggas don't have to be holding the nigga pocket, bro. These niggas is grown men that's making a lot of money. That's the reason why I've said in the past, I'm not a big interview guy. I'm not a big guest guy. I'm not none of that because when you can't, Say how you feel, they not gonna fuck with you no more. If you tell a nigga they lost, or you like, yo, man, I got this person winning, man, shit, I got him winning all three. They ain't gonna wanna interview, they ain't gonna wanna talk, they ain't gonna wanna be friends and shit like that. So, in order to prevent all of that, I just cut it short and don't do it to begin with. Like, we could be cool, we could talk. Danny Myers, my guy, y'all wanna know what happened? He, he got smoked. That line came up off of him when he was battling like three times a day and got killed by, uh, Pass and all of them like a couple years ago. He's back now, he's recovering, he's doing his thing, he's making numbers. But I made a slogan off this nigga. And he's still my man because I can tell him when he won. I can tell him when he lost. Some niggas should practice that same thing because I see a lot of y'all out here and I'm just shaking my head. Niggas be hitting me up like, yo, I hate Easy the Black Captain. He ain't really that good. His, his shit is blah, blah, blah. All he do is rap about drugs and yada, yada, yada. You know what I do when I do that? I go straight to their shit and see where they from. Nigga from St. Louis. I, yeah, of course you're not gonna like what he got going on. You don't like him because him and Holler been in this position for 14, 15. Nigga been running the game for 12, 13, 14 years. The nigga could take a loss. You think they're not gonna book him no more? Y'all think y'all not gonna book him no more? He gonna still get booked. But easy to block Captain got these niggas in a frenzy. He's cracked the cold. He done ran off on the plug and doing his own motherfucking thing. And, and y'all veterans gonna have to get together, man. Y'all veterans gonna have to. I don't see him being back. I can see him being back on URL. I can see him doing things like that. But he's outperformed his contract. Like when he had a contract, like, you know, the rookie deal, the fucked up deal that they give all these niggas to sit on the bench for four or five years and never come out. He didn't outplay that deal. So they couldn't even come to him with a new situation. Or they couldn't come to him with that right now. Yo, we'll give you 5000 to be on Super Fight or 10000 Nigga gonna say no. I just beat him and holler. Like why would I? So they're going to have to figure out how they're going to retool that situation because he done outgrew the situation. The nigga could battle anywhere right now. You think niggas want to call? So, uh, Easy probably don't want to be on no app. Jail niggas don't got the app. <laughs> Broke niggas who ain't got the money, they ain't got it. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas don't have credit cards, but they still love battle rap. They want to see battle rap. He want to be on YouTube. His battle versus Hitman Holler is going to do two, three million views easily. And most of the views that come from that are going to feel like he won. And if I'm going to come from a situation like that, why the fuck would I go back on the shelf? This nigga's on the shelf in an app that niggas don't even know about. Like, they don't even watch them battles. I be watching, I be looking at the uh, the little count under the battle. It be like 130 votes to 145. Like, bro, that, that ain't nothing. Like, <laughs> that's all the votes that go on there? These niggas should be having thousands and thousands and thousands of votes on their battle. But nobody cares. I'm telling you, nobody cares. Unless I care. You know what I'm saying? And right now, it's like, uh, I'm more on the YouTube side. I just dropped a recap with... Uh, the bar for bar joint. It did. It's had like 40,000. I don't want my shit on no app. I want the world to see it. I want the world to see it. Easy got the game fucked up right now, and battlers are, are in a frenzy right now. I don't know what y'all gonna do. I really don't care what y'all gonna do. But uh, y'all better get it together. And soon, too. You know what it is. I'm out. Yeah. Uh -huh.
They say the boy been solid when you ask about your Mac and hard. Always on the line in the trenches like a nose guard. Never been a sucker, man. My knuckle game crazy. Leave your eye like a raccoon punching them out like the baby. They say he a G and he know for keeping it 100. Dirt on my boots, not my name. He's so 100. 